Hello everyone, welcome to JH Softec. Let me discuss SAP SD interview question and answer. What is the purpose of the SAP SD module? Answer SAP SD stands for Sales and Distribution. This module is responsible for managing all activities related to sales, distribution and billing process within an organization. It works on sales order, processing, pricing, delivery, billing and customer management. Explain the components of a sales document in SAP SD. Answer A sales document in SAP SD consists of three main components header, items, and schedule line. The header contains general information such as the sales document number customer details and sales organization the item represents individual line items with product details quantities and pricing the schedule line contains deliver schedule information such as delivery dates and quantities what is the difference between a delivery document and a billing document in sap sd Answer A delivery document in SAP SD confirms the physical delivery of goods to the customer and contains information such as delivery dates, quantities, and shipping details. A billing document, on the other hand, is generated after delivery and contains information related to invoicing such as billing dates, payment items and pricing condition what is the difference between a delivery document and a billing document in sap sd answer a delivery document in sap sd confirms the physical delivery of goods to the customer and contains information such as delivery dates quantities and shipping details a billing document on the other hand is generated after delivery and contains information related to invoicing such as billing dates, payment terms and pricing conditions. How do you configure pricing conditions in SAP SD? Answer Pricing conditions in SAP SD are configured using condition types which define various pricing elements such as base price, discount, surcharges and tax. Condition records are maintained to specify pricing details for different combinations of key fields and pricing procedures determine the sequence and conditions for calculating price during sales order processing. Explain the purpose of the availability check in SAP SD. Answer. The availability check in SAP SD is performed to verify whether the requested quantity of a product is available in stock or can be procured within a specified time frame. It helps ensure that promised delivery dates to customers are realistic by considering factors such as available inventory, production lead times and customer specific requirements. What is a sales organization? What is a sales organization in SAP SD and how is it configured? Answer A sales organization in SAP SD represents an organizational unit responsible for the sales of products or service. It is configured with attributes such as sales organization, code, description, address and assignment to company codes. Sales organizations define the organizational structure for sales related activities and determine pricing, availability and distribution rules. How do you handle returns and refunds in SAP SD? Answer. Returns and refunds in SAP SD are managed through the returns order process. A customer initiate a return by creating a return order. 
which triggers the reversal and relevant documents such as the delivery document and invoice. Once the returned goods and received and inspected a refund in processed based on the return order. Explain the purpose of credit management in SAP SD. Answer. Credit management in SAP SD involves evaluating the credit worthiness of customers before allowing them to place order on credit. It helps minimize the risk of bad debits by setting credit limits, monitoring customer payment behavior and performing credit checks during sales order processing. What is the purpose of the shipping point in SAP SD? Answer. The shipping point in SAP SD represents a physical location where goods are shipped for or staged for delivery to customers. It is used to determine the shipping activities and transportation requirements for deliveries such as loading route determination and career selection. How do you configure automatic account determination in SAP SD? Answer. Automatic account determination in SAP SD involves mapping various sales and billing transaction to appropriate general ledger accounts automatically. It is configured using the account determination procedure which defines the account determination criteria based on different factors like sales organization, account assignment group and account crease. What is a sales area in SAP SD and how is it determined? Answer. A sales area in SAP SD is a combination of three organizational units. Sales organization, distribution channel and division. It represents the structure for sales related activities and determines key parameters such as pricing availability and distribution rules. The sales area is determined based on the sales organization. Distribution channel and division assigned to a sales documents or master data like customers and materials. The difference between a standard order and a rush order in SAP SD. Answer. A standard order in SAP SD follows the regular processing cycle with standard lead times for delivery and fulfillment. On the other hand, a rush order is processed with priority to meet urgent customer requirements. Rush orders may bypass some standard processing steps to expedite delivery and meet tight deadlines is a delivery group and how is it used in sap sd answer a delivery group in sap sd is a grouping of delivery items that are to be delivered together often to the same destination or customer location it allows to, for efficient consolidation of deliveries and help streamline the shipping process by ensuring the related items are delivered together. How do you handle billing plans in SAP SD? Answer. Billing plans in SAP SD are used to create installment based payment schedules for customers, allowing them to pay for goods or services over time. Billing plans can be set up based on fixed amounts percentage of total or milestone based criteria and are managed through billing plan types and agreements. Explain the purpose of a route determination in SAP SD. Answer. Route determination in SAP SD determines the optimal transportation route for delivering goods for the shipping point to the customer location. It considers factors such as distance transportation mode, carrier preference and delivery requirements to ensure efficient and cost effective delivery operations. What is a cross selling in SAP SD? Answer Cross selling in SAP SD refers to the 
practice of suggesting additional or complementary products to customers based on their purchase history or current selections it aims to increase sales by offering related items that customers might be interested in thereby enhancing the overall shopping experience thank you for watching have a nice day